welcome back to the training on data analysis using pandas in the previous video we saw how to perform the merge operation of two different data sets and also we had a look at how to create a copy of data frame in this video let us try to understand how to standardize or make all the column names uniform throughout the data set this is very important because often we come across the data sets which contains the messy or clumsy column names so it is necessary to make it uniform and standardize for the easy access of the column names for this demo purpose i have a data set called car sales.csv file if you look at the data here you can see like manufacturer the first letter of this word is capitalized same way the first letter of this model is capitalized whereas here there is a space between the words and here there are underscore between the words so all the column names are not standardized or not uniform so we will see how to handle such column names okay since i have restarted this kernel i am importing the pandas library once again and we will import this data set car sales.csv file into the data frame df okay so let us try to get the info of the column names you can see here the manufacturer model year sales and so on uh, in certain cases there would be more number of columns in your data set but this info will not provide you complete information of all those columns in order to get the complete list of all columns you need to give verbose equal to true so this verbose equal to true will help you to display information about all the columns and on a single stretch okay now i just have 16 columns so i do not have to worry about it next let us see df dot columns let us try to view the column names using the attribute columns as we saw there are different formats of the column name and it is not uniform so we can make this columns okay dot str dot lower by invoking the lower method all the column names would be converted to lowercase same way we also have the upper this will help you to convert all the column names to uppercase there is also something called as the title this title will make the first letter of every word capitalized we also have capitalize This will make the first letter of the column name alone to capital letter. Okay. You can see here all the column names are starting with the capital letter and the second word starts with a small letter. So here there is a space. So this one is not considered and it's still the same format. Now let us check if the data frame has got these changes. No, it is still the same. The reason behind is the str dot capitalized or the title upper is all applied to the copy of the data frame and not the actual data frame itself. Let us assign this lower. So df dot columns equal to I am directly assigned. Okay. Now let us check the df dot columns. You can see all the column names are converted to lowercase. Okay next thing you need to consider is there are certain columns which has underscore separated or space separated so you need to make it uniform throughout so for purposes like this we have a method called as the rename so df dot rename columns equal to you need to give the column names in the form of a dictionary okay so i'm changing the latest launch as separated by underscore okay and then the power per factor also i'm making it as underscore separated column name same way the year sale value i'm removing all the spaces in between and making it as a standard format okay So you can see here the column names are renamed okay but this rename operation is done on a copy of the data frame and it is not reflected in the actual data frame so directly assign this to the df and you can check the df dot columns once again and you can see the changes are reflected here okay 
so this is one way of renaming the column names individually by giving us it as a dictionary but it is very tough in certain cases in order to rename each and every column so when you wanted to do on a stretch for all the columns then df dot rename columns is equal to str dot upper okay so this will help you to rename all the column names into upper okay so there is also another way of renaming the column using the mapper so mapper is equal to str dot lower if you provide this the pandas will get confused on where to apply the lower operation so that you need to specify the axis is equal to one so this means like all the column names has to be converted to lowercase okay so all the column names are converted to lowercase so we will directly assign it to the data frame so that the changes are reflected and we will have a look at the first two records of this data frame you can see the column names it is all converted to lowercase and uh, the changes which are applied renamed is also reflected okay so now we have tried different ways of renaming the column names and making it standardized for further processing okay meet you in my next video thanks for watching